leave a like on this video or otherwise this spider is gonna crawl in your mouth tonight. This female Fortnite streamer was live with her fans and they were sending her pictures and messages on her phone when this happened. <gasps> oh my god. Bad, 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 bad. It was obviously a really embarrassing moment for her and people were laughing in the chat guys but later this happened. <laughs> Wait, we saw this, right? She accidentally opened up an inappropriate link and here's a clip of her explanation to what happened guys. I have a document where people link stuff for me to watch and it's moderated by a moderator. And I guess someone came in Grim and changed one of the links. It's like looking into a mirror. Next up we have big YouTubers Rise Gum and Keemstar. So here Rise Gum and Keemstar had a video together where Rise Gum was doing this Fortnite challenge and when this video was posted, their subscribers noticed that there was something off with the editing, something which exposed that it wasn't really Rise Gum playing. All right, let's just cut to the end here. Enough of the BS and show you exactly where the Hunter Tamers and Proof shows that these two dummies are faking this live com. Rice Gum looks like you should be operating a corner store and not doing YouTube videos. I'm, I'm just I'm just saying. Oh my God, you guys are such amazing actors. I don't know, Rice Gum. Oh, is he? Oh, 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 here it is. Oh my God, amazing. Amazing. Did you catch it? Did you catch how it's not a real live com? Let me put that. It's super YouTube eight thoughts investigative sleep. You catching it, folks? Are you catching it? Look down here. Okay, now watch. This guy is gonna move still. This character's gonna move and run around like as if he's got actually still someone playing him. And Keemstar, which is the guy who played the game, his hands are completely off of the controller. Hands are off the controller, and the guy in the background is still moving. He's not even touching it. Watch. Still moving. Still building. Hands now are 110% off the controller on his headset. The character in the back is still moving around and building and doing whatever. I don't know if this is even their gameplay. Who knows? Rice Gub, the corner store operator and owner, he's very excited and shocked. He's got to give to, oh my God, Keemstar, all these millions and zillions of dollars worth of V-Bucks. Oh, this is crazy. Play the video. Guy's building. Guy's still moving around. Keemstar is not even touching the controller. He's doing... Next up, we have big Fortnite streamer Symphony, and he accidentally leaked his passwords, including his epic password, which later got hacked and he couldn't use his Fortnite account anymore. Where are we going this time? Oh, great. Nice, dude. Good job. Nice. It just leaked everything. Good job. Now I gotta go change my Epic Games password real quick. He attempted to go change his passwords, but it was too late. Did anyone else land what? here? Because I'm pretty high up. Mother. Uh, what happened? Where'd you go? Oh my god. <laughs> Mother dude. God damn it. You this next one is a really crazy one, guys. So make sure you guys stick till the end for it. Next up, we have Face K and his brother Jarvis. Now, there's a lot of speculation about them faking their videos. There's been a lot of tweets and a lot of exposing videos made by other YouTubers and influencers about them because they think that their videos look staged and fake. Well, if anything, this video is for sure staged. Why? Because their editor accidentally left this clip. In this clip, guys, you can see Face K telling his little brother, Face Jarvis, what to say and how to act in the video. It's it's safe. It's safe. We've, we've got it safe. And I'll just be like, bro, am I going to have to put it back or can you? Yeah. Bro. And I'll just be like, bro, am I going to have to put it back or can you? Yeah. Bro, am I going to have to move everything back? Like no, man. No, Charlotte's here now. We've got Charlotte to help with the rest of the video. Oh. So. Next up, we have Face T if you and he actually forgot to end his stream properly and he went to get changed and came back to see the live still going on. Credit code. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm so hungry right now, Chad. I can go. I'm so hungry. I'm about to die, honestly. Like, I'm big chillin'. 
Yeah. Is he pickaxeable? Yeah. Oh. More, more, more. Oh. Oh shit. Left my stream on. Yo, oh, I got a shirt on. Wait, no, I covered my nipples. Wait, wait, wait. Keep on ground. Wait, wait. All right, later, guys. And for our last one, guys, we have the craziest one in the video. It's about T Martin, this big YouTuber that got exposed that he's faking his gaming videos, at least his Fortnite gaming videos. And people could see this when he posted his video, his Fortnite video, and his face cam didn't match to his gameplay. Watch for yourself, guys. I figure we could stop here. And uh, make our way to Tilted afterwards. We should get a decent amount of action, I hope. I saw a couple other people coming in. Grab this. Go ahead and take our potion. No, nah, actually, I'm gonna... Five ten, five ten, five ten. In time uploading this video, this time with a well needed explanation as to what's going on. Because for those of you guys who saw this video earlier this afternoon before I took it down, you know there was some uh, some questionable stuff going on there, and I want you guys to know exactly what's going on. So. I'm not gonna be, you know, beating around the bush here. I'm gonna be 100% real with you guys. I 100% faked the face cam of the first about six minutes or so of this video. Let me tell you guys why. I record with two different programs when I record. One, Elgato Game Capture records the gameplay. It's super, super reliable. I almost never have problems with it. Even if it crashes, you can still oftentimes recover the files. The second one I have is OBS. That records my camcorder and my mic. That one crashes a lot, and the bad part is, is when it crashes, you 100% lose that file. So what happened is when I sat down to record this gameplay, I started playing, everything was fine. I thought everything was fine. I was playing, playing, playing. You guys know I landed at Snobby, ran all the way to Tilted, nothing happened. When I got into my base up on top of the, the hill at Tilted, I realized that OBS had crashed. And I looked over at the, the other monitor, I saw it crashed, so I restarted it, started recording again, and then finished out the gameplay. And you guys know, I ended up getting a win, which was really, really exciting. And then I realized, holy cow, I don't have the first six minutes on my face cam. The gameplay's all legit, it's all there. I just don't have the first six minutes on my face cam. So I was left with this dilemma, do I just start a match in the middle of the match, starting from Tilted, with like no reference to how I got these weapons and stuff like that, or do I go back and I fake the, the face cam? And that's what I did. And I mean, it's, Obviously, it's not the most honest thing to do. Obviously, it's not the best thing to do, but I just felt like that would make it be a better video because literally nothing happened. So I thought, it's not like I had to fake a reaction to a gunfighter. But that's about it for today, guys. If you did enjoy, then make sure to subscribe with the notifications on and comment down below your favorite color. I'll see you tomorrow. Peace out.